Hello, my name is John Pierce with the product management organization here at Alert Logic. We are the industry's first SaaS enabled managed detection and response provider, delivering unrivaled security value. We do this by listening to our customers and partners to deliver features which add security value. One of the things that came up often was a more cost effective way to meet PCI requirements 10.5.5 and 11.5, which is the ability to detect unauthorized changes to critical files. We have delivered on this by adding file integrity monitoring, or FIM for short, to the Alert Logic agent. Customers will automatically receive this feature as part of their entitlement with the Alert Logic MDR professional. So let's dive into the dashboards. So the FIM dashboard has a lot of critical information uh, at a glance. So you can kind of understand what your deployments are doing at any given time. Additionally, we provide you, you know, different type of look back. So you can look back the last seven days, 14 days, 30 days, or you can do a custom date range. So when you look at file path monitoring status, we do provide you 42 paths that are pre-populated out of the box um, that go across the Windows registry, Windows Server, and Linux. But as you can see, this has will give you, you know, total paths that are monitored and what that split looks like between monitored and exclusions. Over here to the far right, we have the FIM event action trends. So again, this is giving you trending information over the last seven days. So for what was created, modified, or deleted. We also provide you top file paths. So these are bound to deployment, but it'll give you all the FIM events, what that file path is, and you know total percentage of that. If you wanna double click a little bit further, you can click on top FIM events by system. So this will just give you all the different systems and how many event counts that they have. Again, that span across create, modify, and delete. You also have the capability to export to CSV. And just remember when you download those reports, those are tied to the days that you have selected up here. But if you want to take a look at get all FIM events with the FIM event actions widget provides you to do is you can click on it. It'll give you all the FIM events in all time. So if you started configuring FIM in April and you clicked on this today, you get all events to current day. So this is kind of just a snapshot of what the dashboard provides you. Highly recommend coming in here and taking a look at this at least once a day. Um, but let's just dive down to configuration. Really want to go through and show you just how easy this is to configure. <clears throat> so you have many deployments to select from. And this one, I'm going to go to the Microsoft Azure deployment. And when I go to this deployment, you'll see right here, we can do monitor or we can do exclusions. So from a monitoring perspective, um, by default, these are all turned off. Um, if you want to turn them all on in one fell swoop, um, you can click here. You can toggle this back and forth from on to off. Um, but you know, creating a file is really easy that you want to monitor, like a file path. So all you need to do is select what operating system, you know, base path could be alert. You click monitor. Um, description can be you know, whatever, whatever you want it to be. So if we don't do anything further right here, essentially what this is going to do when we click save, it will automatically be applied. And essentially any type of other directories, files, etc., that are in alert or any other directory that is created will monitor and will alert on that. However, maybe you want to monitor, monitor something that is specific. So an alert logic, uh, you know, this is uh, probably a document that we wouldn't want to be released to the general public. So all this means is we will look at this specific file, nothing else. So in slash alert, this, anything in that directory with this name exactly will monitor. But let's say every PDF file is important. So we do have the capability to wildcard that as well. So star.pdf, it doesn't matter the file type, pretty easy. Um, so if you do nothing, as I mentioned again before, not moving over here to the right side, this will apply to the entire deployment. But let's say you don't want to do that. You want to come over here and say, I want this to apply to just a few hosts, right? So I want to supply to my Apache, 
in my app server. Look how easy this is. You click save, boom, here you go. So you do have the capability to come back in here and view. And it's really nice, um, you know, gives you the, the type, the path, um, what exactly are in scope and who made the change, date and time. So that's for monitoring. We'll jump to exclusions really quick. Exclusions, honestly, the same configuration experience. So you select what uh, operating system you want. Uh, we will go with uh, Austin. And if I were to leave nothing here, anything in this Austin directory on down recursively, we won't, we won't alert on. Um, but let's say um, our pencil inventory um, is something we really don't care about, right? Um, do not monitor. So same thing, if we do nothing here, this will apply to that entire deployment. And again, for that directory in this explicit file name. But again, as I talked about before, we can wildcard here, any type of file type. But again, I wanna come over here and I don't want this to my entire deployment. I want this on a specific subnet. So I'll click that, click save. We can go over here and review it, and there we are. So pretty straightforward on, on configuring this. Um, again, you can get up and running within a matter of minutes. But one thing I want to touch on before we close out is while the focus of this release is around compliance, this can also be used by investigators as FIM helps complete the picture by providing critical information that helps detect stealthy attacks and malware. The dashboard presents valuable information and is easy to consume so you can continuously identify and address breaches or gaps before they really cause any damage. Attacks are constantly evolving and we're always watching, identifying and prioritizing what to do next. We are relentless in protecting your organization. Alert Logic, our knowledge is your advantage. Thank you.